I just had the chance to play a little bit more with the Pulse application and notice one thing interesting. Many of the actual dashboards come already configured like this one. And actually you can see what the AQL query was made to do this. If you are not familiar with AQL, uh, there is very good documentation uh, in, in the, with the product. There is the IBM Security Academy and I have uh, some tutorials that I made with Mutase a while back and I'm going to put the link to those in the video description to the playlist of those tutorials. It's not hard to uh, to really uh, know if uh, learn if you don't, haven't done it yet but it's very useful and, and will serve you a lot with Curator especially if you're going to be doing any kind of API programming and stuff this will become invaluable. So again many of them come already configured but some of them need you need to actually uh, configure so if we look at this for example that shows the event rate uh, of course we don't our EPS uh, our event collector is not called like that if we want to learn what our uh, uh, event collectors are we can do a AQL query for that so if we do the same the the, the this uh, query select parent from events group by parent will get all the event collector in my case I only have uh, one so I'm going to grab the, uh, the actual name because we're going to replace that uh, on that dashboard that we just saw so in here instead of that name let me see if I get this right I'm going to put my event collector and of course I only have one Therefore, I don't need these two, and I don't need that comma either. So let's see if I got this right. Uh, yep, and we get, we can actually save it, and now we have configured that particular, uh, well, I don't need these uh, different axes because I only have one. That's good. Now I'm ready to save it and now we have that uh, if we refresh this uh, icon actually this is in the process of refreshing itself we'll see the data here and you need to do the same with your uh, flow processors as well and the same goes with many of the other dashboards uh, for example if we look at here at the, these miscellaneous uh, metrics I actually show in the previous example how I made uh, the change uh, to make it flat. I think it looks better and you see some source to destination path that, that, that line going in there and just to refresh that all I did is uh, I copied this geolocation query in uh, function in uh, AQL and named this column source, uh, geosource, copy it here and put that, uh, put the comma and put the column geo destination, and that uh, did the trick. And the same goes with the other. I, of course, you can always create your very own new dashboard, and start from scratch, and put things exactly the way you want it. And remember, you can actually move any one of these, uh, you know, charts, and the whole thing reaccommodate itself. Uh, in the offenses I noticed something very interesting uh, this one needs to be configured of course but this one on this tabular data there's actually something very nice I want to share with you here here when you click on thresholds you can actually specify what threshold we have in that in, 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 in that one we only got offenses uh, between 6 and 8 uh, so that's what we saw all in red but you can actually add a threshold and say you know between three and you know uh, so we had a threshold you know on, on the three and you can actually change the color to have the tabular data uh, reflected uh, in, a, in, a, in, a, in a different way always when you make the changes into this you it is good to run a query to make sure that things are okay and because all my all my offenses are on the threshold of uh, actually uh, of magnitude 6 the top offenses then they all look now 
uh, yellowish, but you can actually on this tabular data, and I'm sure the tool is full of uh, different options and way of making uh, your uh, curator interface looks more modern and nicer, and it might be a good candidate to, to use that uh, flat uh, TV that uh, you most likely have at the, at the SOC 